100 pound loom, not just design a cool type. Right. It's like the, the, the towers that we have in the class from the Boston with towers, that's structural engineering. So we have weight that we actually put on these less an ounce of Boston towers, and they can actually hold about 50 pounds if we go to correct it. Right. So they're, they're, they're in there, and it's, it's amazing. People don't believe it. Is there anything in here like where you can measure, you know, tensile testing yes. or any of that? Yes. So, so you have yes. a, you have a <coughs> And the other thing that we're going to be looking at water are the VEX robotic systems. Um, hopefully we get some in. Yeah. But the so we have somebody from the project lead the way and it'll be the next year from um, principles of engineering. There are 3D parts right here, 3D print parts right here. This is a little robotic hand. Mm -hmm. Mr. May, is it possible to get some introductions for your guys over there? Okay, let's see. Question? Okay, hey guys, we're getting some introductions from the students here. So, who do we have at the, uh, the computer there? Uh, Brian Smith. What grade are you in? Ninth. Come on, let's go around. Um, My name is Emily Acosta. I'm in ninth grade as well. Nice to meet you, Emily. My name is Isaac Acosta. I'm a sophomore. Are you guys related? Yes. She's my younger sister. Okay. Mm -hmm. What grade are you in? Sophomore. 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 Okay. My name is Christian Canales. I'm a freshman. Freshman. Okay. How did you guys uh, find this classroom, Mr. Uh, May? I mean, what, what made you choose this class? Uh, he came to our school last year. Uh, we what, what school was that? Uh, I was at Davis. Oh. Yeah. He came to different schools and he introduced us. He introduced this to us, and he told us if we wanted to be in this class, he let us sign up for it. And he showed us a lot of stuff that past students made, and we were like, "Oh, that's awesome! I'm like, why would, why can't we do this?" So I just decided to sign up. Great. Well, all, all of us did. Mm -hmm. So you come from other schools to attend the class? Middle here. schools. They were all recruited from eight Oh, I see. But you, but you had to make a decision to come to Compton High School in order to take Mr. May's class, though. So you chose Compton over Centennial or over the other school? Oh, you made it. Yeah, right. And you're within the Compton High School or school school district. I see. So right. you could opt in or out. Around. There's, there's three high schools. Mm -hmm. And and to be honest, the three high schools compete for students Got it. Um, based on the curriculum. But I will, uh, I will tell you, the, the best and the brightest don't come to Compton. No. Because there was never anything here for them. Um, are they going to they go to Long Beach schools, CAMS, King Drew, or Paramount? They go to the other schools. So right. they go so out of the district. And, and, and oh, let me qualify really? that. Yes. Yes. They go outside of the district. They go outside so of the kids district who live in Compton go outside of the Compton. Yes. They can do to other schools. Really so well, because we're from it. That's Right. So, so one, of, one of the district's biggest yeah. issues yeah. is trying to figure out how to retain the talent here.